everyone, I am a student in the Vashon of Jyoti. Today, I am a twist the tale of Sudhamurti's book, How the Sea Became Salty. A long, long time ago, the sea water was sweet and drinkable. How it became salty is a remarkable story. Let's begin. Sridhar was an orphan. He lived with his brother and sister-in-law, Keshav and Leela. One day, Leela said to Sridhar, Why don't you do some work and earn some money for our house? Then Sridhar said, Oh God, I have to work now. And went away from his house. They lived near the sea. When Sridhar was wandering, he saw some dwarves. He went to the dwarves and asked, Can you give me some easy work to do? I want to earn some money. The dwarf said, Yes, we have some easy work to give you. We will give you thousand sacks of salt. You have to deliver it in the nearby country. We will give you hundred gold coins for your work every day. But in one condition, you have to go in the morning and return back in the night. Then Sridhar agreed and started his first consignment from the next day. When he reached the center of the sea, he got an idea. Idea? I should throw the salt sacks in the sea. The grass will not get to know either I throw it or either I delivered it in the nearby country. This happened for a long, long time. Then people in the city started complaining about the salty water. Then the dwarves came to know Sridhar's truth. To teach him a lesson, in his next consignment, they then gave him food or water to eat and drink. When Sridhar reached the center of the sea, he was feeling thirsty and hungry when he was throwing the salt sacks in the sea. Then he started searching for some food and water in his ship but couldn't find anything. Then he thought that he should drink some water from the sea. Then he, when he put it in his mouth, he spit it out. Because the sea water was salty. Then he realized his mistake. 